Hi everyone. My name is Andrea Alonso and I'm a general surgery resident at Boston Medical Center. We're excited to share the results of our study evaluating the association between relative surgeon volume, CEA to TCAR ratio, and stroke risk. We know that surgeon experience and volume are associated with improved outcomes following both operations. However, in light of changing practice patterns, we sought to evaluate the association between relative surgeon volume ratio and postoperative outcomes for both operations. To do this, we conducted a retrospective cohort study utilizing the Vascular Quality Initiative, carotid endarterectomy, and carotid artery stent registries. We included both symptomatic and asymptomatic cases and assessed surgeons enrolled in both registries. We then categorized our exposure variable by the total number of carotid endarterectomies performed over the total number of carotid endarterectomies plus TCARs performed by a surgeon during the study period. We then categorized surgeons as having either majority TCAR practice more TCAR, more CEA, or majority CEA practice. The study had over 32,000 CEAs and about 18,000 TCARs. We found that surgeons who perform more a majority of one type of operation, either TCAR or CEA, have higher postoperative stroke risk for the operation performed the least. There was no significant association between relative surgeon volume and cranial nerve injury, mortality, and return to the operating room for bleeding. Therefore, Based on the results of the study, we conclude that surgeons who offer both operations should maintain a balanced practice and skill set to reduce the risk of postoperative stroke. Thank you.